Okay, here we have my model Jillian. We're gonna create something beautiful here. We're keeping the same exact length, which is removing bulk in case a little more texture out of the hair. I'm gonna start off with sectioning. Put the pinky behind the razor and you put your thumb on the pivot and that's how it's held. I'm going to take vertical sections and just remove bulk. This is a 90 degree, that is 45 degrees. We use a 45 degree angle, very light strokes. And all we're doing in this case is keeping the same length and removing excess hair. We go from the center out and the center out. As you can see, we have a very severe line at the bottom. We're gonna soften it by going horizontally. Doing the same technique here. This will allow the hair to have a little more movement and not be so rigid. Taking the next section down. Could be about an inch and a half or so in width. Depends what you're comfortable with. The same technique again, just turn the center. We're not taking any length whatsoever out, it's all bulkness. We're taking a diagonal forward section. Diagonal forward. We start in the neck in the rear of the head. And I'm working from an inch and a half of the roots to about mid shaft. That's where the bulk is located. on the other side. I'm taking the remaining section down. And I'm gonna just texturize by underneath the hair. If you texturize above, you more likely get a little flyaways. So I'm gonna take sections and underneath. 
Okay, we'll move back. Now we're gonna do some long layers on the top. We start off with the sectioning, the parting where she wants to come the hair. Now we're gonna layer from the center out. So all we're doing is bring it up to here and layer up shorter through here and longer in the ends. Give a little more height in the top. So you lift up the hair, place your razor under your finger, and you slice it up. Take the next section. We go on the opposite side, do the same exact thing. Now I'm gonna bring the hair forward. I'm just gonna soften up the perimeter. Place the razor on your fingers. On the other side. As I'm working in the back area, I notice that it's still very heavy at the bottom. I want to soften it up a little bit. So now I'm going to free cut it by lifting the hair between my fingers and just gradually, using a 45 degree angle, softening the ends removing the severe bulkness. So that gives you an idea of how much hair you can take off the, with a razor without cutting any length off. Now we're gonna style the hair and show you what the finished look will be like. As you can see, we were able to leave the same length on Julian, but yet yeah, achieve a lot more softness to the hair by just removing bulk and not really cutting any length, just reshaping it. And also by the long layers that we gave her with the razor, that was to get a little, get a little more movement. And the hair becomes softer and very modern. I'm gonna finish it with a little microwave fiber from Sebastian. Just run your fingers through it. Scrunch it, piece it out, leave it nice and natural, soft and beautiful.